Yeah, I'm just gonna let the game load up. You won't see anything happening, but the Elgato is never silenced. There we go. Bring. Now that's interesting. There's not supposed to be a black screen there. There's there's not no signal. Well, what do you know? And it's broken on. Alright, give me a sec. I'll just return to the booting up screen, I suppose. Ugh. I changed one thing that probably won't do any help. Ah, I feel like this cable will play nice. Right, let's see if anything worked. What is it with consoles? It worked with a PC fine. Alright, there we go. Now we just have to not touch the fucking thing. We got a deal? I hope we have a deal, Elgato. Uh, let me just move into the corner. Ah, ah, there we go. My TV's kind of in a corner, just so I can, uh, you know, uh, fit everything in the room. It's not the largest. Try to find the best, most comfortable position. Kind of cramped. <laughs> like, I'm a claustrophile, but... Not in a sexual way, I just like them. 
All right, so last time we um, killed the legendary jackalope twice. Right, so we got West Deckens, another American Appetites, and Marshall Johnson. Ooh. Oh, hey, Preacher. Oh. Suddenly I'm allowed to run? Okay. Still booting up. Hey, Preacher. Hey preacher. Hey preacher. Hey preacher. Hey. Hello preacher. Don't make me unleash the fires of hell. Oh please do. Hey, preacher. Sorry, mister. Sinner, I'll beat you to hell. Darn Walton gang took another stage, I heard. He moves in mysterious ways. I'm going to tear up Toy Creek from his face. We've got some collateral. Yeah, I just want to knock him down one more time. Come on, just knock him down one more time. Just once. There we go. No newspapers, I take it? Nope. 160 dollars. How much do we have? That is a significant portion of money at this time. Hmm. This thing probably needs to be reloaded. Hang on. There we go. And the weird golden thing again. Hello, doggy. Hello. Hello. Right, let's go and see that American appetites. Stranger mission. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Come on. I was miles away from that cross. Oh, well. Guess we're going shooting. <laughs> ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who are getting drunk and nice murdered ticker. settlers. Last night they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? Sounds like we gotta kill a few. All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. Hey, wait up! I uh, think you, whatever you're taking there, I think you need less of it. Let's hit the breeze, boys. Marston, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East, the result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was you. It ain't science. It's alchemy. No more a scientist than I am a priest. 
But people can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, that West Dickens. I can't understand a goddamn word he said. A more flannel-mouthed Funko artist I've never met. Hey, Marshal, you see those vultures? Might just be a dead critter. Marston, take a look. Eli, you too. Yum. Ain't never a dead critter over here. Come on. Ain't no survivors here, Marshal. Man, this don't look too good. Hmm, you don't say. Somebody was so busy killing people they went and dropped their gun. I just got a Winchester for that I was like saving up for. Well, come on. Whoa there! We'll head for Ridgewood Farm. See if they know anything. This is definitely in the middle of the era when Rockstar thought that holding. Rapidly pressing X, or if you're fortunate, holding means go fast. They're still in that age. God damn it. Not, oh no, it's god damn it. Man, more dead bodies. The fire's still smoking. Those scumbags must still be around. Come on! Let's go! Come on, let's ride! They kind of got too far. Sons of bitches! Didn't you want to run a gang of outlaws? This is the soundtrack for getting chased by marshals. Gotta go to the shitter to check. Take out the shotty for this one. In case there's someone there. No one here. Horse. Thank you. Oi, get back here. Come on. No, leave. Strange horse. Shoot that door open. Oh. Okay. Reload. He dangle. Holy sweet mother of mercy. took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> All right, boys. I'm surprised we didn't check the house. Why have I got that? I want this. There we go. Do we have any dynamite to throw? I'd assume not. Master. Jesus. Any of them gonna come out?
I was reload and check the back door. Check it. You are the worst of shots, sir. Come on. There we go. But you can only enter through the front. Modern rock star right there. Ain't you a pretty little thing? I'm gonna enjoy this! Oh, for fuck's sake, get to the other side. See my Deputy waiting for you in the shed out back. Make a run for it when it's clear. Oh, thank God. See in this one? Come on, there we go. Make a break for the shed when the coast is clear. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Thank you. They said they were going to kill us all. I at least appreciate that there is the swap shoulders button. Let's see how the are doing. I'm just be uh, Sorry about this, partner. not too honorable. Ink. Alright, let's head off then. I've gotten my cash. Someone try to escape into the cells, but then some robbers started chasing him down like wild dogs. I thought you were supposed to protect us, Marshal. You fooky men. You ain't nothing. You're just a man on a government payroll taking money that the rest of us have to pay for with our lives. Yeah. What is wrong with this country? Not up, men. The man that kills the boss of that bunch gets $50. It ain't about the money, Marshal. These are people's lives. People's homes. <laughs> let's go. Get on your horse, boy. Hurry, boys. Let's get after him. Well, let's go get some uh, 50 friggin' dollars. Headed for Fort Mercer, Marshal? What? Williamson's men? Maybe. All this sure looks like their handiwork. Makes sense if they took this road. Come on, Marshal. This might be our chance. What's your beef with Williamson anyway, Marston? Let's just say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell you talking about? Some people I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. He was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. The Baron and Ma. Is that somebody on the, the Baron and Ma? You just walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Everybody, take cover! In that shed! You call this a shed? Get ready, boys. Here they come. This is getting intense! Nobody leaves this shed! Aha, uh -huh, there it is.
How are you still alive? There's the last one. There he is. God damn it! There's more of them. God damn it! Wait for the red to, to die down. I saw you poking the head out. Come on. Guess things didn't go your way. Oh, come on. That's fish mouth. There's something that you're still breathing. Come here, boy. <laughs> Come on, Missy. Give. <laughs> oh. Norman Deke. <laughs> I see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is going to help us get to Bill. <coughs> Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Deke. Mighty kind. Fuck you. <laughs> Hog time. Let's get him to jail. Well, I got a fifty dollar. I just need three. Clearly going the wrong way. Or not. Other mission up. Or a B. Yeah. You! There's some errant Throw wrongdoers that. down the way seem to have eluded us. Round them up or shoot them down. Now keep quiet. <laughs> Welcome to hell on earth, mister. Oh, we'll capture this one. Okay, go pick him up. There we go. Heavy one, ain't you? Put him on. There we go. Going on a little ride. It's all the same button, so it's all very context sensitive. And I'll just drag this one, hopefully he won't die. Dude, he... He was... completely incapacitated. I hope the horse doesn't die. Because of the train coming. He just got vaporized. You take it from here. You'll get along fine here, son. Now get gone. My pleasure, partner. Vaporized. And the fucker gets did anyway. And he is just wandering off. Right, new horse time. Oh, you get back here. Please don't tell me you're stupider than the last one. We just stood there and evaporated. There was a rattlesnake there. 
So what is um uh the rest of the challenges for other things? Search Coos Chapel. The American appetites. I'm about to. Oh, I'm gonna try. But just suit from the tailor. Martin's game. Ugh. Headphones are quite tight today. What a what? Uh, what would they be? Challenges? Those are in stats. Journal. There we go. Kill five coyotes before a coyote damages you. It's easy. Oh yeah, F kill five wolves with your melee knife and skin five wolves. Six desert sage. Yep, tooth ridge. And the treasure. Five coyotes. Let's go. Allow my horse to regain some. I'm still going the right way, right? No, I've just gone fucking around it. Where the fuck is B? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, I guess Bonnie needs something again. That's it. Alrighty, Jesus. Alright, let's just... Let's do delegatory delectables. <laughs> you okay, lady? My husband's missing. <laughs> These bastards won't do anything. But he's a good man. He don't drink, nor lay with whores. And he's been, he's been missing for three days. Let me guess. You went missing up in the hills? How did you know, mister? Just a guess. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. But people seem to go missing up there. Oh, oh my God. If he's gone, then what do I do? We ain't got Same thing the other two did. And I'm with the family way again. As I said, I'll do what I can. Horse. Hello, doggie. Hello, hello. Look at that doggie. Good boy. Let's head up north and uh, go to Hanging Rock again. Yeah. Oh, not the social club, Jesus. I'm going the wrong way. Wrong way again. Endlessly going the wrong way. It doesn't help that the entire landscape is green. Uh, green and brown cliff. That I can't speak. Whee! Here. There we go, sharpshooter rank three.
believe American Appetites is somewhere along this, uh... Further up this. Across the county line. There it is! Not exactly near Hanging Rock, is it, anymore? My leg! Oh, 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 mister! Mister! Some city fella just attacked me and broke my leg! What? He broke my leg! Some city fella. Guy got kind of creepy on me, and then he got violent. When? Just now. And there's a bar uh, in the background, I'm probably gonna, gonna die. Go too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Thank you, mister. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Why won't you people just leave me alone? Yeah, I'm guessing that guy's the guy who's been doing shit. We'll see how tough you are. Please! I'll do anything! Lied. Don't take me back to that man! This is a nightmare! <laughs> Yeah, this guy's gonna be the perp, probably. Oh my good lord! Please get that man away from me! Uh, uh. Hey, fella! <laughs> you broke this poor fool's leg, mister! This maniac tried to eat me! We've got cannibals in these here hills! Please help me! What? Please. Fella's gotta eat now. Fella's got to eat. Uh, <laughs> save me from this freak, please! Please! <laughs> <laughs> Save the man or let the cannibal eat him. There you go. Now you can now you two can learn to get along. I don't want to carry either of them, I want to ride the horse. Learn to get along, or I will be back and hog tie you two on the train tracks. So long. Alright, let's do some of West Dickens missions. Because, uh, that'll get me some better, uh, dead eye. Look off shit hills. I'm coming through. Whoa. Who the fuck is shooting? What else I could do? Is that just a hunter? Gotta kill what? Why not? Birds. I like watching a man. There we go. Keep practicing. You'll get there eventually. Easy. You beat me, Mister. Nobody ever done that. Y'all should cut the leg breaker free. Well. Too late now, they can go get along. Whoa. 
My house can just wander around. Dear sir, hello. Five and ten PM. What time is it? Well, time to waste all my time in the bub. Uh, sorry, bear. That is actually like, a response button. You care to see if black wings your lady gave my boss the ruins? Hello, mister. It's away. Wow, word spreads quick. Have a seat. We need another poker player. I just need to like. Do I need to leave and then back in? Or... Oh, there we go. Now it's back up. We need another poker player, says the one guy. Don't see why not. I just have to face off against this one guy, and then I've got the the thing I need. Right, so we have a five. Okay, then. I'll place Bold. a bet. What? The, what? Oh my god! Ah! Ah! What do you know? Ooh. Ooh. Where did the poker player's graphics go, though? Um... That looks like a 3D model not even I would make. That's that's like the level below me, and I'm shit at 3D modeling. <sighs> Let's just double what he has. Ooh. I'm in this one. Fucking hell, this guy is a... Uh... Yeah, I'm just gonna call it. In Queen, I've got two jacks. This guy is cocky. You always gotta be a little cocky. Check. I know your game. Uh, still got nothing. He's got nothing too, though. Luckily. Fuck. <laughs> God. The gun is a higher quality than him. Man got shot dead at this table last night. Duh. I'm playing with a fucking slender man. I'm gonna raise that. Call. Seven four nine. Three nine. Ooh. It's no fun if you don't ever bet. Are you kidding? Pathetic. May the worst man win, gentlemen. Okay, let's do this. Interesting. Got a four and a five, and I've got a four and a nine. That's... 
Let's just bet ten. That's a tiny number, you fucking coward. You better give me a real card. Um, yeah, considering his hands aren't fucking real. I think I'll raise. Call you. Oh, I've got an eight. Last bet was seven, let's go to twelve. Oh, he's just calling. So have we got a king? No, just... Well, I've still got a pair, so... May as well. Two pair queens and tens? Oh. Oh, he had a queen. Best of luck to you. I'm gonna buy a new iron with these winnings. And I'll raise you. <laughs> that was quick. I just have to bankrupt this fucker and then, then we're good, so. Oh, he's coming back! He's alive. I got the mountain oysters to stay right in it. High five, ace. Pet. I'll see what the next take card is. Hell, I'll take that. Five, six, seven, ace. Uh, yeah, nah. Well, his hat's still nothing. Uh, I should just call three, but eh. That's raise. You're pathetic, sir. Make sure you deal from the top. There is a way you can cheat, by the way. But I cannot be bothered. Alright, so we've got a pair of jacks. Oh, he's cocky. And if you want to spook him, you bet a lot at this point. But I'm not betting a lot. I'm in this one. Pair of tens? Pair of jacks, bitch. Fuck off. Why are these cards sticky? Why are these cards sticky, he asks. Ugh. Ew. I call. Check. Queen and eights. Yeah, nothing here for so far. Oh, his hat's come in now. Is he fully recovered? I'm gonna raise that. Nine, six, ten, Jack King. May as well throw something in. He has fifty chips left. Once I get to five hundred, he should be done.
Jack and Queen. Eight three six. Let's throw some betting in. I am ch chipping away at his, and he's gone again. Got six, seven, eight. Just small bit. Jesus Christ, dude. I'm just going to call this time. He is so low on uh, chips that he's just cowering. So it's going to take a while to... Uh, he's back. He's at least got polygons now. Do polygons equal fear? Why don't we raise the stakes a bit? Damn it. Ugh. We got now seventeen. I just have to raise. That's all I do. That's all I have to do. He's got nothing to say for himself. All in. Two pair. Oh. Oh, my luck turns next to you. All righty, boys. Just kind of have to win one, one proper game. Being an eight. Yeah, if he's checking, I'm checking. That is correct, is on 16. This is just taking its time. Well, seven point. I could have used this last round. Seven left. Come on. One. He has one. A small blind of one. He's going all in. I can only check. Side pot to award you win for what? A straight? Oh. Wins what? <laughs> oh, this has just gotten really pathetic. I just have to get let the game play itself now. We're just going to draw until one of us gets a pair. Oh, I won two. 
Aha! Finally. Suck it! Not down this way. Where is that extra door? There should be a door on the back here. Oh. Alright, can we do a Walton... No, uh, West Dickens, should I say, mission? There we go. Alright, you fucker, give me some of that snake oil. Probably just gonna be a shot of vinegar. And I can tell you with no uncertainty that miracle cures are no laughing matter. I bid you a good day, sir. <laughs> oh, Mr. Marston, good to see you. How have you been keeping? I'm well, Mr. Uh, Mr. West Dickens. Nigel West Dickens of East Cheap, London, New Waverly, New York, and Armadillo, New Austin. At your service. At my service. At everyone's service. At the service of science, of knowledge, of life. Uh, <laughs> how are your wounds? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, uh, much, much better. But then, they would be. Mm -hmm. Would be. I know a cure for all ailments, Mr. Marston. Ah, I'm sure you do. It's I'm fox sure here. Two dollars an ounce. I could live forever. Oh, but for you, sir, I do a bulk discount rate of one ninety-five an ounce. <laughs> as long as you buy a hundred ounces or more, that's a lot of immortality. Uh, give it up, old man. That's Mr. West Dickens to you, boy. Give it up, old man. <coughs> uh, listen, Marston, I'm broke, but this stuff is good. It works. I need a healthy young man like you. <laughs> Come along, and let's ride over to my newest customer at Ridgewood. As opposed to an unhealthy young man who would get uh, destroyed by this thing. Okay. At least the graphics are alive now. <laughs> All right, John. Let us Ridgewood Farm. What, you mean that place that was uh, absolutely mauled? The gift of language. It doesn't Don Marston use big fancy fancy schmanty words. Hey folks. How do you explain the fine battle in which you find me? Last time you saw me, I was knocking at death door. You should thank the doctor for that. I reckon you were acting it up worse than it was. Did he say Orcasio? As in Orcasio Cortez? Suddenly I like this guy. <laughs> that was his own fault. I was barely moving. Not reversing, I'm breaking. No, it is on a sham. Follow me in on foot. See you shortly, and remember, showmanship. Well, it's in this empty space. 
Oh, I think it's sniper rifles. And what's in this one? This one might be snipers. What's this one? Hey y'all, you became quite populated considering what happened only a few hours momentarily before. Ah, uh, the squelching. Friends, hardworking souls of Chola Springs, gather round, gather round. Do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute chronic sciatic, uh, uh, neurologic or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article that cures headaches, neuralgia, uh, earache, toothache, backache, swelling, sprains, sore chest, swelling of the throat, contracted cords and muscles, anxiety. It's cocaine. It's it's nerves, definitely cocaine. Stiff joints, wrenches, dislocations, cuts and bruises, and oh, hey, maybe even heroin. And bigger than the healthy man. <laughs> well, can you prove it, old man? Oh, I'm sure there's some customer here who could. Prove the qualities of its fight. Take a drink right now. You, sir, come up here. Step right up. Spot the main character. That's the spirit. Ladies and gentlemen, pay close attention. This poor, wretched volunteer, entirely unknown to me, will demonstrate the effects of Dr. West Dickens' own patent tonic. Be you a cowpoke or athlete, this miraculous elixir developed with the wisdom of the East keeps the muscles supple and relaxes the cords. It loosens the joints and gives a feeling of youth and vigor to the whole system. Not possible, I hear you say. Well, doubt no longer. Faith can move mountains, but I ask not for faith. I am a man of science, and today science will be vindicated. Your eyesight is greatly improved, is that not so, friend? If you say so. That's right, it is. You heard him. What a good sport you are, sir. Now, gaze over yonder at that porch. If you squint, you may just be able to make out the skull that's hanging there. Go ahead, friend. Shoot that skull. Nah, I'm too short-sighted. The miraculous eyesight you now possess. Uh, I'm only allowed the pistol. But where is that skull now? Oh, the shiny thing. Remarkable! The eyesight of an eagle, granted by imbibing Dr. Westicken's own patent tonic. Anybody can make that shot. This man is a fraud. If your eyes so damn sharp, why don't you try shooting my hat out of the air? My friends, our test case has been challenged to yeah, shoot sure. a gentleman's hat out of the sky above our heads. You can fool me, you ain't fooling me. Right. There's some dead eye stuff. You see how sharp you is with a moving target. Steady yourself, stranger. Come on. Come on, give it a chuck. Go home! Have you ever seen such an eye? Behold the power of the elixir! Hip shot as well. Hey! Hey! What? You think you can put a hole in a man's hat and just walk away, do you? They don't work like that. Come on! Are you a man or not? A challenge of battle has been offered to our volunteer. Look at him! The tonic is coursing through his veins! Akila. You just have to mash R2, really. Look, he's burying his head into the floor because he's not getting attention. Look, he's over there. Go get him! 
Hello. Hello. Here he is. See, that's what I was trying to do in the jewels. I have plenty for all. He just doubts it. No harm in trying one bottle, I suppose. Well, I think that went kind of well. Loki has moistened my hand from the lick. Chasing after cattle or murderers. Not the likes of you, mister. Don't be like that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'd like to say my goodbyes. Head on back to the real world. Uh, 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 wait, sir. I, I've been thinking about your predicament. And I, I think I may have an idea. I've been thinking I could be your cunning Odysseus. Beware of the Greeks burying gifts, sir. Mm -hmm. Williamson had better beware. We will make them into Trojans. I don't rightly get you. I want you to go and see my old friend, Seth. Uh, he can come across as a little curious, but I'm sure you two will get on. He's a most often found at Coots Chapel. He's very devout. Why see him? Because between him and me, we can get those gates to open for you, and you can walk right in, just like in Homer's great Trojan yarn! <laughs> what gates? Everyone in the Wild West just speak entirely in fucking riddles. Horse breaking jobs are now available. Yeah. Let's go. I don't suppose I live here, do I? Is this is this a rent? Yeah, that's a rent. I ain't rent no shit, I only buy. Come on, come on. I mean, if you have the money for it, buying is cheaper than renting. In the long term. Come on. The camera does not like those cacti. What in blazes? Hello, hello there. Howdy, Miss. Uh, what are you doing out here? Um, I'm thinking. Stoned. Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. On the train from Blackwater, perhaps. Yeah. Yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Yes, sir, I was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, miss. Oh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So uh, faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. Why don't you move that one? You're trying to move a mountain? Oh, no. Uh, I can't do anything. But with faith... I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. So, uh... Can take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. Oh, uh, I get such clarity out here. I see things purely. The world is so beautiful. Ah, slash nature is metal. Cool things that'll kill you. <laughs> including illness. Nothing's gonna kill me, sir. Well... Take care, then. <coughs> oh, guess I'm buying some medicine. Yeah! And she's gonna refuse it, or I'm just gonna come back here and she's just gonna be a corpse. Probably the latter. This game is, uh... Predictable. Hey! 
Shut up, fuckers. Doom. Jesus Christ, how bloody far away is Armadillo? Yeah. At what point do you just kind of wish for a, uh, a car? Yeah. A vehicle. As a general practice, it's open. We ain't gonna maintain. Oh, please, it's Herbert Moon. Who? I'm Herbert Moon. I've just been robbed. You gotta stop him. Come on, horse. Come on. Come on. Get out the way, you. That's a great fucking wanker. Can I hog tie the fucking out? There we go. The amount of bullets I've taken. I must be Superman. Are you trying to shoot me? He's... He's trying to attack me because I ran over him. I don't do so good when I can't move free! Come on! <laughs> Look at this fucker. Is this the same fucker that tried chasing me uh, at the end of the last stream? And he turns around, he ain't gonna fuck with no one who's helping the shopkeeper. Uh, speaking of, sir, may I buy some medicine? You done? Uh, what you got, Gunsmith? Nope, we can't put no price on safety. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, I'm always after items of quality. I hope you find You're not a smith, you're just supplies guy. Are you still trying to fight me? Same, bro. Howdy, sir. Um. I'm so sorry, officer. Are you fucking kidding? This guy was attacking me. I'm not even trying to shoot that fucker. Oh my god. Can you tell this is a Rockstar game?
What debt? I accidentally shot one guy because the game just would not stop aiming at the fucker. And the other guy sh uh, tried to beat me up. Oh man, I'm gonna kill a man. Give me the time and I'll do the crime. Go to best. Make sure any future altercations terrible. Let's go. Where is this fucking store then? You open? No, I didn't kill the shopkeep. Times three, you should be open by now. Here we go. This establishment welcomed you. It is time Miss McFarland hey, got partner. herself a husband. You ask me. I keep foreign and Jewish made goods no, out of my store. Help our all American right. families. Adonai, Cleveland Bay. These are all horse breeds. Hmm. Apps. Anything else I can Hello. do for you? Oh, forgot I had the gold. A fine choice. I guess I do have to go to the doctor to get medicine, that's annoying. Nate Johns is more corrupt than the politicians in my country. You won't find anything Jewish made in this establishment, sir. There. That's what I got. I'm fixing to get me one of them new automobiles. Please come again. I've never lost a single piece of merchandise. What the hell out? No Anti-Semitic little shithole. I'm just jumping into him. That, that can simulate beating him up. What's the news today, sir? Might be some Easter eggs in this. Plug tobacco. Tobacco fights tuberculosis. Telephones. Spurs and pelts wanted. Steve's landing. All Steve's for sale. The marriage is. House of Miss Molly Brannigan. Boy missing. Animal bait. Beds. Always is the best ways. I believe that's a cheat unlock. Uh, 
Let's just pay off this shit. Murder of law officer. Oh, there's none here. Yep, we got the finest selection. Hello there. Nothing. We got the Second Amendment for a reason, don't we? The marshal ain't no man in my eyes. The Second Amendment is for a well-organized militia, aka a people's militia, like Switzerland. Position. I would like to purchase some midi sen. Hello there. Actually, why? I fucking have medicine. Fuck's sake. Get out of the road, doggy. Be back here. Orc, heck. Alright, I really should have paid a bit more attention. Come on. Ah, damn it. Let's go. Well, I wasted all that time and paid $90 for nothing. Oh, actually, I've got a new challenge, I should. Five birds from a moving train. E. D. I have to get the train. Come on, Nelly. Miss Jenny. Let's just pretend I went Miss to get Jenny. some. Don't look like the Almighty's much inclined to help you out here. I was kind of worried about you, so I brought you some medicine. Oh, oh heavens. Oh, praise you, Lord. I knew you'd save me. Excuse me? You see, it was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. No, it was through some bullshit and I spent ni I spent ninety dollars. Jenny. Can I take you back into town? Praise you, Savior. I knew you'd save me. Can I take the fucking medicine? <laughs> Will you come with me? Oh, I'm fine here, mister. I'm in heaven. <coughs> heaven. Oh. And there's the coyotes just waiting for the easy prey. Orbs. Um You won't be needing this, ma'am. I think I just witnessed a murder and didn't actually realize it. Yeah, yeah that sounds like me. Are you blind? Move. Just someone getting stabbed. Oh, they're playing. Come on. The, uh, I noticed there was something there, but... 
dress looked like some kind of like knapsack or something. It was just like a hunter setting up camp. Anyway, let's go find S. Scoot. I only remember this character as Coot because you just go to Coot's chapel. Whee! Come on, come on! Take the shortcut. Go Scoot Chapel. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Marston. Exhuming and other fine hobbies. Excuse me, are you Seth? Who are you? I'm a friend of Mr. West Dickens. My name is Marston. John Marston. Goodbye, John Marston. It's been a great pleasure. I need your help, Seth. We need your help. Me and Mr. West Dickens. Let me be frank for one second, partner. I hate people. It was people who got me in this mess in the first place. What mess? <laughs> Look at me. Look, scrambling around, looking for maps, half insane. I ain't washed in six months. My hair falling out, my mind's going. So he's a libertarian, what then. Happened? What happened? My partner. He stole half my map. I never would have done that to him. Never! Look at me. Who did this to you? My partner. My boy, my man. Moses Ford. I don't have the facility to tell you what I would have done for that man. And what I would do to him now. Why? Because he stole half my goddamn map. And what map's that then? The map, partner. The map that tells me where it is. It. Where, what is, friend? I ain't telling you that. It. <laughs> That's what's there. Tell, <laughs> it's mine. It's mine. All mine. <laughs> sure. And where's this Moses now? He's at Benedict Point. The law got him for exhuming. Some people. They feel differently. Not Moses. Him and me are the same. The self same. Well, come on, Seth. Let's go see Moses. Get you your map back. Then maybe you'll help me. Cowboy of no name. Let's go. Well, his name isn't Shane. Kid. Come on then, partner. All right, where are we off? Please hold my headphones. Have fallen. There we go. There we go. Take that low. Digging up graves and looting from the dead. Ha, ah, hypocrites. The whole damn lot of you. Are you saying it's better to steal from the living? They're corpses. They don't care none. These people have been laid to rest. You don't know nothing. I talk to them long after they've been forgotten by every other fellow. I tell them it's all right to be scared and alone. I embrace them when they're stinking and rotten. Ew. I met some sick bastards in my time, Seth. But you? 
You're special. Folk is cold and heartless all their life. To me, they gets warmer when they're actually cold and heartless. Surely that makes sense to even you. Not exactly, it don't. Are we really living anyway? Do you exist outside my mind? Maybe we're both having really is a libertarian, dream. isn't he? We up, we'll die. I certainly seem to be in some kind of nightmare. An undead nightmare. Da 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 da. What'd you say? I, I didn't say nothing. I just heard you say something. You're a crazy man. You should get that head looked at. Seth, I need someone who can get a wagon inside Fort Mercer. I was told you could help me, but I'm not sure you even know what day it is. I don't. I can't even tell you what year it is. I knew this was a waste of time. So, you want to go after Bill Williamson, do you? You know Bill? Oh, yes. I met Williamson and Deke. All them boys. Sometimes they call me on when they get some special job needs doing. I got a reputation as a man who do things most other fellers won't. Now, that I can believe. I reckon you can get in there, no bother. Assuming you help me find this map, that is. I mean, isn't that what we're doing anyway? Get in your friggin' map. About this map. Nothing much. Just unimaginable riches and such like. A spark of hope that lit a rage and fire I can't put out. I thought as much. Another treasure hunter losing everything in the search for nothing. Oh, I lost it all, partner. My wife, my children, my business. Good riddance to them all. I don't eat, I don't sleep, I don't wash, and I don't care. I know. I can smell you from here. It used to be about the money, but now. I don't know who I am no more. All right, this is it. Let's stop here a moment and come up with a plan. As far as I know, Moses is being held in that shack. There's a couple of deputies keeping guard outside. Can you distract him so I can sneak in for a quick parlay with that son of a bitch? I'm sure I can think of something. Do I have to get bounty? Um... Leave them away from the shack and out of sight. Somewhere out past that hill. Um... Uh... Oh, yep, I've got a fucking thing. One god awful assignment. I know. This place is deader than a side of bacon. I just paid that off. I swear this wasn't this glitchy uh, on my first playthrough. Best. Yeah, I fucking realize that. You've lost your wanted level and the bounty remains on your head. I need a fucking... I'm done. This was being weird because my. 
elbow was on that. Good job getting rid of them clowns. Now keep an eye out in case they come back. Moses? Oh, Moses! You got a visitor! Oh my god, Seth! They arrested me! It weren't my fault! Ah! Get the hell away from me! Get that slippery bastard! I need him alive, though! You ain't that damn law! Uh, no, I stole from the law, actually. Come on! Come on. Here we go. This ain't none of your business! Son of a bitch! Game is... Quality. Let me go. Did that little. Who do you think you are, Ooh, Mr. There's his hat. Pick his hat. Pick. Ain't no horse. Seth did sell his own mother. Yep, and he probably did, historically. Just split it between us, just me and you. Whatever he told you, it's a lie. <laughs> Did you think I would find you, Moses? <laughs> Moses, you son of a bitch! Where's my damn map? Damn you, sir! Damn you, sir! You've always been a twitching little freak! I ain't telling you shit! Ah! Then I'm gonna... Cut you uh, up, uh, piece by piece. <laughs> Till you find your tongue. Friend, this man's uh, gone crazy uh, in the sun. Uh, I suggest you take my advice and start talking. Shut up, Marston. I want to cut into a bona fide uh, man's flesh. Uh, Ain't never cut into a live uh, one before. <laughs> uh, odd, odd fellow's rest. It's an odd fellow's rest. Uh, get away from me once and for all. Well, ain't that a damn shame. I was starting to enjoy myself. I think you gone pissed yourself, Moses. They do that in every Rockstar game. Those deputies went and put a bounty on your head. Best we clear it now. Don't need the law on our backs. I don't have no money, but I got me a pardon letter. Here, take it. You earned it for helping me with the Moses. Ugh. Come on. We can pay it off in the telegraph office. Ah! Ah! Best we deal with this now, mister. Come on! I prefer the front door. Well, hello. He's just been watching everything that's going on. This should clear my name. This here is a fresh start. Don't do nothing foolish. Anytime now. you want to get on with it, it's fine with me. But how did he get a pardon letter? So, mister, thanks for your help. Don't worry yourself with thanks, Seth. Just help me when I come ask it. No problem, mister. We got a Stranger! Strange horse. Hey, Stranger! My, my, take a look at you. When you take a look at you, you look like you've seen trouble, mister. Enough for a hundred men. Trouble has a way of finding me, mister. Do I like the sound of that? 
Do I ever like the sound of that? Trouble with a capital T. That's just capital. Whatever you say. Cold, tough, but with a heart of gold. The cowboy sings his lonely song like, like a dog whose bone is made of wood. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. I, I was just writing my next piece. I've been sent out here to provide a little frontier joie de vivre for the ladies back east. I don't understand a word you're saying, mister. Yeah, my mom felt the same way. And now she wrote me out of her will, and there's no hope for any of us. <laughs> uh, uh, Jimmy Saint, sir, at your disposal. But uh, please don't dispose of me just yet. <laughs> what are you doing out here, Jimmy? Capturing the spirit of the West for a monthly back east. You know, I'm uh, sending them my oh-so-witty and oh-so-pertinent missives and gaining myself a little prize in the bargain. So it's action I'm after, and action I'm going to find, too. Wild men, cheap women, you know, guns, that sort of thing. <laughs> well, you have fun. Fun? <laughs> I'm going to have the time of my life, sport. I tell you, mister, the time of my little old life. <laughs> little is right. When I find your corpse, I'll, uh... I'll say... Hi. Let's go! Hang around here, the stage coach? No. Where are we even on the map? Mine's over there. Got a West Dickens again. It's always best to do the West Dickens ones early, just because you do get upgrades to your uh, your dead eye. And upgrades to your dead eye just mean general good. They wolves. Coyotes. Just coyotes. Yeah. I ain't got no interest in no coyotes. I'm only out for damn wolves so I can kill them with my knife and skin them. Might actually have to learn how to use a knife, but. I'll, I'll get to that when I get to it. You know? Dickens, I need Deadeye. <laughs> Liars, cheats, and other proud Americans. Is there any other? How are you, sir? I'm all right. I met up with your friend, Seth. Oh, <laughs> Seth of the Dead. <laughs> yes, <laughs> interesting fellow. <laughs> you don't meet many men these days with the moral fortitude to cut straight to the chase like that, do you? <laughs> Thankfully not, Mr. West Dickens. Yes, uh, contemporary society is remarkably <sighs> harsh on professional exhumers. But did you know that in ancient Egypt, nice strong it was black a form valued more highly than literature? I believe Seth comes from that school of thought. <laughs> oh, very interesting. Look, you thought any more about our plan? Ah, your plan, dear boy. Your plan. I am merely the help, uh, not mercifully the arbiter of wisdom. What you are, dear boy, is the man whose life I've saved twice now. A man who sells lies and deceit to unwitting people. A man who, if he doesn't help me, I won't think twice about putting a bullet through his skull and feeding the vultures myself. Uh, you see, Mr. Marston, you have the exterior of a violent man, but the soul of an angel, and that is what I think I cherish most about you. No, it's just the standard rock star guy who's like, heart of gold, but really he just does whatever uh, anyone else suggests to him.
without much of a second thought. Um, we need some extra lubricant to oil the machinery of business, and uh, this being America, <coughs> that lubricant with which we concern ourselves <coughs> is money. Money? <coughs> what are you talking about? Oh, we need weapons. Armor plate for the wagon, extra hands, <coughs> and I need some danger money. So, let's sell some more of these cures. <laughs> sell cures? Around here? Do you want to see me lynched? <laughs> no. The sport of kings. Racing, my friend. The sport of kings. A noble activity without reproach. Exactly the kind of activity where a lying, cheating, degenerate like myself can prosper. <laughs> but come. Let's finish the loading and we'll discuss it as we drive. <laughs> now, sir, do that to reach. As much as I like the conversations, this is taking a little long, so. Let me guess, I take one of those. Here we are, John! Gap tooth reach! That horse has been following me. What a good boy. What a good boy. Drivers! Y'all know the rules! But for you newcomers, this here's a fair race! Keep to your manners and let the fester cart pass. So now that's been said, y'all can get to running each other off the road like always. All right now, count to three. Ready, set, go. All right, ram them away. Oh, fuck! This control's weird. Not sure if that's because there's a delay or what. Acceleration and the camera turning have to be done separately, so. Ugh. Like driving an RC cart. Ugh. While trying to keep it on a video. Somebody told me there'd be bridges. Uh. I almost ran that fucker over. Uh, so how long does this go on for? Is it just going to be some endurance thing? Throughout most of this, I've managed to keep my horse at like near maximum stamina. Well, at least there's a finish line. Uh, let me just glitch over the tracks first.
Ding. Bucky miles ahead. Hell of a race, mister. I'll take care of this cart for Mr. West Dickens. Come on, John. I suggest we be a hasty retreat. Right. Best remove ourselves from the stage before somebody decides they want their money back. That's a lot of trust in, John. It was just sat there. Well done, sir. Well done. Having you as a ringer has netted us a fine profit. <laughs> we seem to be wasting time, old man. Oh, patience, my friend. The Trojan horse cannot run before it can walk, if you'll forgive the metaphor. Next, we need to procure some grand and overwhelming firepower. And for that, you need to contact an old friend of mine. Goes by the name of Irish. Irish? Yes, uh, he's an interesting kind of fellow. Uh, yeah, I wonder what kind of nationality he is. In uh, Armadillo or some other town around here on some Bacchanalian revel or such. Uh, Great. An alcoholic arms dealer. What could be better? How about a drug addict? I got three dollars for that. Get on in. I will just keep doing his missions just so I can get a You almost ran yourself over there, dog. You good doogie. All right, let's get some fucking dead eye by drinking a bottle of snake piss. Some of Jesus Christ. Donny boy. Follow me this way. Put your little head out. Ah, oh, there he is. If only they release a Red Dead Redemption game on PC. Might be able to more effectively shoot things. Thanks for your help, mister. Now I trust you'll return the safe to the banker in Armadillo. Out the way, horse. I wonder, could I just... Steal? I could, couldn't I? I mean, there's nothing I actually need. Funny wise. While you have a weapon drawn, your horses will try and stay on the road. 
Because hmm. I want to apply Brex. I can die, dude. Die! And that guy can stay. Uh, you don't get much done in a RDR playthrough. Maybe shoot the guy who's fucking next to me. <laughs> fucking... Can the controls... respond? I'd have done better just robbing the fucking safe. I think I ran over a rabbit. Weaker because really not hitting much. It did say with a gun drawn, not just while you're aiming, right? Folly. Forty five dollar dues. For the crowd. But I don't believe Really? The house gonna pop over. the distance. There we go. Spawn a war horse. Still have it. Yay. Come on. I don't know why I have that. This fucker's way better. As long as it doesn't, you know, disintegrate. Come on.
And my horse is an idiot, as per usual. Perfect for me, I suppose. Right, now we're travelling in the complete opposite direction. What a wolf. Come out here, you balky fucker. Come here, I need you for... Come. Has it gone off the hill? Down the bastard hill, isn't it? Damn it. Rest? I ain't got no time to rest. That isn't Desert Sage. Whoa there. Yeah, fuck it, just cut across. I'll do me Rest. nicely. Yeah. Where we're going, we don't need roads. Another rent house. Oh, yeah, that's a rent house, all right. Yeah. Well, at least we're actually at Dickens. time is it? Great, two hours. How are we going to pass the time this time? We're going to find more wolves to stab. Wander into the wilderness. Have one bait. Run a bit further that down then. Where is Wolfis? My perfectly camouflaged horse. A pheasant. Hide perfectly in the cactus. Ok. 
kidding, it's in an in-game hour, there we go. You'll blow your cover. The hell is that? It was moving very... Oh, we got owl. Got another like half hour yet. Somehow I have to entertain myself. Is there anyone I can push off of these things? Prospecting. You know, I've seen there will be blood. In circles. Hola, senor. That's racist. Fucking finally. Hi, hey, why don't you play Red Dead 2? Because I can't afford Red Dead 2 right now. Mr. Marston, sir. John and uh, I wanted to uh, check back on the story of this one. Mr. Marston, uh because I've uh, forgotten it since. Okay, okay, okay. So I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met. But my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, and certainly Bill Williamson. But first, you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> you read my mind. I can only deduce you've been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give... The most ordinary of intelligences, a remarkable insight. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Please, sir. This That's more of a sight in. Is nothing short of embarrassing. Think for a moment, sir. Think. I'm thinking about how much of my time you're wasting. Um, sir. Sir. I am about to do something. Which I greatly discourage in all wise and rational men. A selfless act for you. But, sir, before I act selflessly, allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. You mean give me some of your damn dead eye? Right, sir, come and let's go visit some of our fine friends in the other oil business we have here in Plainview. These men need all the help they can get. But yeah, I, I entirely forgot the story of this game, so I may as well play that before I uh, even attempt to play uh, the second one. <laughs> Mingle with the crowd until the show starts. Hello, I am Mingle. Hardworking souls of That was a quick mingling. Do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute Chronic sciatic, uh, neurologic, or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia, uh, toothache, earache, backache, 
This man is a fucking charlatan. He just got done swindling us down at Cholo Springs with this song and dance. I say we tar and feather him right now. I say we shoot the uh, bastard. I think it's time we take a business elsewhere. Uh, I apologize if science is not your forte. Good day, one and all. Somebody get their feet. I have to go around the long way. Looks like we've been scuppered. Let's get out of here. I'll ride. You ride shotgun. Well, if I ride shotgun, I'm. Actually, using shotgun. You better run. Survive, but uh, he won't be catching up. <laughs> Look out, Chad, there's more. I recognize there's more. I don't have my shotgun. It sure is lucky you came along. You did. Lucky for who? Just give me my fucking repeater one. I don't want it. You don't need some of that tonic, sir. A bit slow on the draw. God damn it. Come on. You can do it. Maybe you need to think about a change of career. I will never give up on science, John. This is gonna take a while. How can these people harbor such bitterness? Well, I ain't surprised. Oh. Sorry, Nessie. Ridgewood went through me like a dose of salt. Make sure you keep me up to date with some shells. How many guy people has this guy ripped off enough that they want to kill him? Because there is a whole fucking lot of them. Taking a sweet time getting here, dude. Okay. 
carefully, slowly. Hang on. Good job, I've run out of ammunition. We made it, John. There's Quavosek up ahead. We fucking crossing the border or what? Again. It always impresses me with the speed with which a group of men can turn from passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. Well, yes, yeah, so perhaps we should shell the tonics business for a period. Let's say we try our hand at racing again. There's a meet at Ratskeller. You're trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. Well, I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging bender of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. cavalry. Forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. <sighs> All right, then. Uh... My dog is pretty much demanding he be taken out, so uh, I'll just be right back.
And with that, I return. Headphones on. There we go. It's chewing on a dent stick now. Ah. Right. Dead eye, please. Lot of kings and liars. Mr. West Dickens. I don't even care right Let's now. Go, my dear boy. I'll show you the way. Right. Let's go. Fuck's sake, of course they have any excuse. Okay, all things considered, hopefully we can get through today without running into another army of your satisfied customers. Onwards and upwards! I refuse to let the blind stupidity of the proletariat derail my calling in life. Nothing blind about it. I'd say they saw right Fucking! Are you chase my? Everybody knows you're as crooked as a dog's hunt. Ah! I resent that invitation, John. It's about. I wasn't implied. Are you chase my fucking mountain tell. lion? Help! If you're such a successful businessman. What are you doing, living in a cave? Fucking Christ. Christian, isn't it? If you say so, are you familiar with the concept of philanthropy, John? I'm surprised you are. Oh, I don't do any of this for myself, John. I hope you realize that. You're crazy, old man. You seem to be forgetting that I've been part of your ridiculous charade. Fucking hell. It's quite a ride, John, hasn't it? We haven't gone that far. No, I mean us. Bridgewood Farm, Gap Tooth Breach. Find you. We make quite a team, you and me. Brains and brawn. We should consider a more permanent partnership. This partnership ends as soon as I have Bill Williamson. I appreciate your help, but I've just about had it with all your scheme. You need to realize what's at stake here. I know, John, I know. Just win this race and we'll be ready. I give you my word. There it is, John! Rapscaller Port! So you know, the, uh, the mountain lion in this game can destroy you. I'm glad I've got my war horse for that. Can't beat a good horse race. Gentlemen, this I think will be a it can take you out in two. No shooting, stabbing, cliff pushing, rock throwing, cactus grinding, neck lassoing, setting fires, or other acts that causes a rider to unfairly lose his weight or swaying in unison. Or Are you gonna go? Yeah. Come on. Is that all you got? Come on. See ya. Hey. Yeah. Come 
I got a fucking war horse, sons of bitches. Never seen the movie. I don't suppose holding X to maintain speed is a, an option in these races. Well, they aren't even on the map anymore. That one is. This is not even close. I think the main problem with this game though is it it's kind of like the point where Rockstar like really went away from actual open worldness. Like, say in GTA 3, when you get a mission, it would be like, kill this man, just like halfway across the map, and you didn't say what with or anything, you didn't have to shoot him necessarily, you could uh, use your creativity. Oh, okay. <laughs> Glitch down the cliff, why not? Well, anyway, um, in this one, this one started railroading you a lot more. Like, San Andreas had that a bit, but this was where it really started up. Well, uh, I guess it was GTA 4. This just continued that. I forgot GTA 4 existed. It's not that memorable of a game. Unless you're just mentioning, like, games with Slav. I don't really see that much, actually. Let's take a moment to bask in the glory of our victory. Have we got enough money now? Yeah, yeah, all right, all right, all right. Uh, yes, once Seth and Irish have furnished their side of the bargain, I think we should be ready. Quite a team we've assembled, don't you think? A bunco, a grave robber, and a drunk. How could things possibly go wrong? Right, is that all of his missions? I saw there's some more. Uh, yeah, there should be a house here. Ooh, blackjack. Lose all my money at ball games. Hello, John. Start chase. Well, it ain't the fanciest, but it'll do. Where's that stranger? Much obliged. Sad man. Sad man. Hey, partner, I need your help. You and every other fool around here. No, they took her. They took my love. They stole Jeff's heart and they, they took her away. What what are you talking they about, took, friend? They took my love. They took Jeff's love by them gangsters. They hide out of tumbleweed. <laughs> can you help me, partner? Partner, can you help me? Oh, I doubt it. But 
If I head up that way, I'll see what I can do. Help a fella out, partner. I have a soul. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Hello, doggy. Oh. Where is that? Tumbleweed. Down the road. Literally. South. Down. I should be around for fucking plants. Well, desert say. Back here. What was it? Easy. That does it say. Are these beauties? Let's go. Keep an eye on the map. Yes, my TV does not have the uh, resolution. The uh, look for flowers at high speed. Slow down. I got some holes again. Holes, stick. Go knifing him. Back here, I will stab you. Bitch, I'm wide open. Come here. I will get the achievement. Deliver unto me your flesh. Well. Oh. Canal. I'm never gonna get this, am I? Whoa, whoa. That isn't Desert Sage. My dad is deserted at the moment. Go. Hmm. What do you want? Yeah, just wait, serve it. What you doing here, mister? The horse is gonna be the one he's talking about, isn't it? Your poor wretch of a man lost his mind. Seen him at Rascal or Fork. Uh, my man? My man's dead. Ball man shot him about a month ago. Shot him in the back, coming out of a cat house. Gave himself his medals. Just like I gave myself to that poor bastard. Unless you've been to hell, you ain't seen no man of mine. Then where is she? Who? Jeb's girl. Who's Jeb? Creepy kind of guy. Short black hair. Mustache. <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> this is Lucy. This is Jeb's girl. You dumb fool. Took it off him about a week ago. Then you better come with me. <laughs> yeah. We better get her back to her man, huh? You gonna made my day. What a fine romantic you is. <laughs> well, come on then. Alright, follow me. Fuck yeah. Come on! 
want to give the horse to the creep. Them's pathfinding's not too good. <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face, mister. I bet you thought you was being a real hero. I should never have listened to that crazy fool. Mercy, mister. What's the fastest route? Ah, so did Jeb offer you some kind of reward for this? No, miss. I was just helping him out. Well, ain't you the sweetest thing? I'm just like you. A real sweetheart. Come on! I Let's get that back quick. Didn't Jeb strike you as being kind of funny? Most people out here strike me as being kind of funny. But Jeb, he's a special type of funny, I'd say. I'm inclined to agree with you, miss. <laughs> he got you good, mister. I'm glad you find it so amusing. Whoa there. Okay, it's just saving for no reason. All right, you fucking creep. Here's your horse back. Hello there, Mister. Mister, you found her, Mister. Oh, I found her. All right. Come here, girl. Come to Daddy. Oh, you're so beautiful. I'm so strong, yet such a lady. I long to hold you. I missed you so much. You got problems, friend. Oh, I ain't got no problems. Not now that she's back with me. Oh, I remember a cold night that we spent together. Please do not describe Every that. It's been cold without you, my sweet thing. Oh. I thought I was sick in the head. I told you he was funny, mister. Life out here does that to people. Oh. I should know. My daddy kept goats. Please do not speak of this ever again. Um Okay. From the back it just looked like he was a a half man. What if I just stole that horse now? Let's go pick some desert sage. Come on, easy up there. Hey, oops. Yeah. Ah. Sir Tasagi. What if I hear Lazo the book? Lazo the to be peaceful. You just left me. I doubt you'll be needing this. Around the tree. Do do. Are you kidding? Whoa! Get the hell off. Fuck. Fuck. 
Holy shit. Fucking aim at the thing. Fucking hell. I am taking that thing's skin. <laughs> I think I have to kill one of those with a knife for a later challenge. <laughs> that thing kills you in two hits. It has... It has the chance... ...of killing you technically in... What? Oh, yeah. Technically in one hit, because it can knock you down and then knock you again before you can get up. It's, um, good design. Very fair. I even going? I guess I'm just looking around here for the sage again. Maybe a wolf. Ideally not more cougar. Dealt with two alone today, I don't need any more. Where is that sage? Purple beauty. I could just start sniffing really hard. Right? Okay. To being a fucking hero. How many fucking bullets does it take? He isn't actually aggroed. He's just fleeing. Can now wear the duster. Bollard. There we go. Oh, okay. Kill and skin eight snakes. Kill a coot. That's the challenge. Wow. Win 1,000 total from gambling. Every gunsmith, specifically. $200 worth of hoobs. Execute 20 people. To be a savvy merchant. Why? Why? Why do you have to execute 20 people? Well, I can be Clint Eastwood now. Continue fucking looking around Gap 2. There. Let's go! That guy's still running. Bye, Eagle. Find snacks as well. That's one.
in more flower. Where flower? I'm basically just using that as a zoom. I don't have any binoculars yet. Or was there actually a rattlesnake? Come on. Slow down. All right, where are those shots coming from? And, uh, this box. What he did. And my horse is gone. Let's go. I'm on desert saggy. Getting late, I need more menial tasks like this. Down here. Yeah. You're fine. Some. Oh, fuck off. A third one. A coup. In it now. Tough one, ain't you? That's one. I think I killed over here. This will fetch a good price. Oh fucking, there it is. Damn critter. For fuck's sake. I didn't know cougars and wolves worked together. Oh, my war horse. She only with him for the money, and you look fine this day. Don't walk in front of me, Dugger. Oh, it's not like you lose anything but time.
That's what I wanted. Let's go. Two more, it looks like. I haven't I killed one. My melee knife. Why? Why isn't it updated? I fucking killed one. He asked bullshit. Died because I killed it with a knife. Come on, easy up now. You're welcome to share this campfire. I don't suppose this is a Skyrim horse, is it? I hear some gunshots going. Come on. What, Hunter? Cedar, you think <laughs> Come on. You try to shoot me now. Never know. That's a sec. One will ever know. That was gonna be nice. He had to get all uppity. Where's the rest of that fucking desert sage? I just stepped on a crow. Aren't crows supposed to be intelligent? For oh, fuck's sake. Where is it? Fucking thing. I will hunt you to fucking extinction. Come on. Fucking thing. Get this over with. They want me to kill that with dynamite? Another one. 
Ow! That's a. I hate these things. Same. He didn't even thank me because I was too busy shooting the other cougar. How many? Uh, what were you eating? One of the most powerful animals in the game, and it's hunting in packs. And there's another one. I'm gonna be rich off of the stuff that's in here. The guy who was running just die. Okay. There's another one behind this. Oh, that's a deer. Bank. Buck. Last still. <laughs> Don't stand on the tracks. Do not happen to the last one. No, no, no. Get off. You would be vaporized if you stayed there. Let's go. Finding that fucking stage. Bring it. No, no. Don't go after the horse. This is dirty. Challenges are annoying. Actually updated it. Thank you for actually working this time as intended. Hey. Right, just two more desert sage and three more wolves apparently. One more Desert Sage. This is the wind down part of the stream. I don't think I'll do any more missions. Nope. I don't care what your home truths are or whatever you call them. I ain't buying. That info Wars book back in the day. Complete. Right. Next. Red Sage. Around in around Rio Bravo. Oh, bravo, I say. Whoa there. Is that a dog bark or a wolf? <laughs> I 
mean I may as well just run around in the wilderness until a wolf shows up. As aimless as I've been. Otherwise I have to wait for the train. The nearest stop is... I think it comes up here, but it doesn't actually stop here. Maybe gap tooth breach. The only what place I know it actually consistently stopping is, I guess Benedict Point as well. I'll be the closest. No uh, stations. I don't know why it goes up here. There's no stations. Actually, no stations there. A needle. Jump on the thing. Boss, move. Shenanigans. I don't even have to take part in this. Fuck off. Where is it? Well, if I had fucking dynamite, that'd be great. You stink. Let's go. I heard happening. Yeah. Apparently the happenings have happened. And I stepped on more wildlife. Great. Yeah, why don't we go put on a duster? Make us look a bit more Clint Eastwood. Does look better anyway. I think you steal if you're going from that one, so I'm not gonna. Well, let's. Covered and dust. There we go, a bit more Clint Eastwood. That, um, that isn't a duster. That's a trench. Trench coat. What's this, then? Roscoe Duffy. Yeah. Careful, officer. All fry. 
Anyway, just as there are like split down the middle there. Like, you see where that small split is? Imagine if that was full. That's a duster. Because the legs have got got to basically cover the legs to from dust while on a horse. So each leg has its own thing. I thought better of you, Rockstar. That guy out too. Just need to go further into the brush for. No. Yes. Looks like people left here in a hurry. Don't pass to my horse. Back here, you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Fucking coward. Might come back. This will fetch a good price. Not coming back, little wolf. Use you. Bye. Oh, here we go. Oh, got another one over there now. Whoa! Fucking. Alright, now I just gotta skin him. Tough one, ain't you? Should probably have some easier tasks after that one. Kill a fucking cougar with dynamite. What? What are they thinking? That's that's something you do for an achievement. Not a basic part of the game. There we go, Master Hunter. I'll take this though. What were you eating? Right. The next one. Three balls and three armadillos. Goodbye, wolves. Now, I've seen one ball just kicking about somewhere. No idea which way I'm going. Eh, if I just follow this road, I'll just end up at Armadillo anyway, so... Let's go. May as well. Comfortable? 
And I'll just go and hog tie the other one. Not, not fully. I could just uh, keep one on my horse and have my horse follow me. And I can carry them both back at the same time. Now that's efficiency. It's a pleasure to help. And execution. <laughs> All right, let's see. It's for the honor I uh, lost for killing the guy that was shooting me. Carry on. Come on. Five of us might do for twenty minutes. Okay. Is that twenty in game minutes or twenty? actual physical minutes. That's going to be useful. For the later uh, thingamathings. Two crows. Where am I going? Boots. Alright, so now I've got those, done a few missions. Mostly dicking around. Armadillos are sometimes pop around here. Let's go! Have a quick scan for them. Hey. Oh, 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 what's that? What's that? How about we finish off with this stranger mission then, eh? Potion going on. Let's see what the potion is. I don't appreciate gang violence. 
wasn't gonna stand by and let them terrorize this town. You got anything? There we go. Uh, defend residents of Collar Springs from Walton Gang. That. That's not. Is Amadil in Collar Springs? Complete a horse breaking job and search Solomon's Folly. Whoa! Alright. Go to the right. Or oh, just back entrance. Now there's a leading man if I ever. Hello there. What brings a fine okay. specimen like yourself to my humble establishment? Establishment? This place looks like a schoolhouse. Such limited thinking. Have you not seen the future, my friend? We make dreams! Are you not a devotee of the cinematic arts? Arts is what you call it? Granted, I only have a poor imitation of the true Nickelodeon. But that is why I am... Nick, 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 Nickelodeon. Austin with its cheap land and fine climate, the second center for the motion picture industry. Hell, a couple good years and they'll all be here. I'll produce adventures. I must have been produced in Germany for as well as melodramas around this time. And even some fantastical shorts for children young and old. Heard there's an old ranch ripe for exploitation just north of here. Apparently the owner is a frequent lover and loser at the liar's dice tables over at Thieves Landing. If you could do me the favor to wrest control from him, I'd reward you quite highly. A career in the arts awaits. I don't mind see what I can do. Not much of a high stakes gambler, and movies seem like drivel. Drivel? No, sir. We speak. I'm gonna skip that so I can try and catch the train. See if I can. Get whatever from whatever. Get here, horse. Come on. I require the climbing aboard of this train. And nothing can stop me. Fine. Uh, uh, climb down. What was the actual... Task itself. Five flying birds from a moving train, as opposed to swimming ones. So no penguins. Eyes on the skies, lads. This will be the last thing. The camera does not like the trains. They're not even moving. Birds, birds, birds. Where are you?
I like that it doesn't look like it's flapping in the wind, it just looks like it's... floating away from me. I hope the microphone has been picking this up. It looks like it's floating away from me. Excuse me? Brain robberies don't really net you that much worth. The best chance is really just rob all of the people on it and uh, then rob what you can, because otherwise it's just not really worth the trouble. if I'll find any birds in here. How long does this tunnel go on for? Jesus. Shifty eyes, Marston. They call him Shifty eyes, Marston. Yeah. I apologize, I just have to go for a second.
over and done with. So it was a sudden departure, right? The end of the whole thing, but. Eh, I can needed to do it. At the end of it, I did find a Loki just kind of sitting in a chair. On. You some bitch, get back here! I just suddenly fell off for no reason. Lovely. Fucking hell. Also, I noticed that these trains are free. Get moving. Ain't got all day. I got birds to shoot. I like all more to do. What time is it actually? There. Oh, that's five. Bird should be out soon. Okay. Here. Knock something off. Tell you probably what happened. He was uh, organizing the pillows on the bed and. Uh... Am I gonna get hit by that? There we go. Might improve my aim actually, crouching. Whoosh. Anyway, uh, he was organizing the pillows into a nest because he, he likes to do that. Uh, I'm sliding off, you see. Alright, eyes on the skies, boys! That was one. Ha! Ah. That's going nowhere fast. It's surprisingly... ...fucking... ...annoying to get these done. Again, if there was a mouse and keyboard... Ah, two! It's gotta be more... ...choosy in my targets, I suppose. Three! Four! Five! Hello! Da 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 da! This. Right. The. Let me ride it.
game. Do you mind? It's just straight up not bringing up the prompt to ride my horse. Am I going to have to run back to the Carlin Ranch? We all need help once in a while, friend. Da -da -da. Well, absolutely no context things are actually coming up. Wow, okay. Well, how did that happen? Was it something to do with a fucking train? Me leaping off it? How about we try and find the nearest cliff and jump off it, eh? Oh, well, here's one. All right, so uh, to end the stream tonight, let's let's just uh, deliver ourselves unto the floor. Thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find the uh, archives of any previous streams uh, in any description down below. There's a highlights channel if you want to see the best of. Uh, most recent vid was the best of 2018. And, as always, friends, have a nice day. Not in place, you twat. Same.